and then go from there and try to fish the whole freaking cord through the wall like it was supposed to be and then go from there so that's not as hard as it really I'm making it sound I will have to do a video after this showing you exactly what is going on with that and how that turned out and how to so this is just really good all advice how to fix stuff especially when you have amateurs coming in your home to install a cable I don't want to throw no names out so I'm not so up here wow well, look he actually did this one by the book <laughs> right wall play two screws coaxial like I showed you outside right from underneath the the window which I was not agreeing I wanted it over here literally like I said or over here because the chimney is like literally right here I got a plug in there so literally he put it over here that would have been excellent right there done deal finish we originally had it up there with my Asus router so now I gotta take that Asus router down take all my <laughs> cord management I got going on my power brick down there and move that all over to this over here so I'm now having to redo my whole networking <laughs> up here just because this idiot decided to take the easy way and not agree to do what we agreed on oh, it's just er, <laughs> it's teeth grinding er. and then the size of this thing is huge I, mean, I know I got big hands but look at this thing <laughs> Uh, is humongous why do you need such a big freaking cable modem and Wi-Fi capable okay that is another thing I should bring up if you guys are so Wi-Fi capable and and it, I get Wi-Fi through you guys why is it that only this little part of the house here gets Wi-Fi everything else from that floor down there, the, the um, garage entry slash sliding door living room, so upper living room, lower living room, and then the Joe Cave, all does not even get a signal. That is horrible. Ah, oh, yeah. And then we went from Sprint to T-Mobile, and Sprint had some really good Wi-Fi. It had good internet, period, for the device. I had no signal problems, nothing, unless I went to the mountains, literally. <laughs> to the mountains. And then, obviously, you know, I had to be spotty. So, T-Mobile says, oh, this is how you're going to solve that issue. Personal cell spot. Unleashed a 4G LTE signal booster. I haven't even opened this thing to even get a look at this. She opened the box and then said, oh, they're here, Joe. I was like, great. So, obviously, T-Mobile's got something up their sleeve here because I've never heard of this. It's like they're almost saying, hey, you know, if we can't own towers or own enough towers, might as well just put, I guess you'd call them hot spots, all over your town, and then people can just flop off of those. Okay, interesting. Most of my devices are wireless. So my Samsung computer here, the Power Mac G5 downstairs, um, the tablets. Uh, where are my tablets? Uh, it's a mess up here. This is what happens when you have a kid. <laughs> uh, okay. Ah, oh, yeah, the tablets down there with her. Ah, uh, that's a scary thought. <laughs> Okay. And I think this has power? No, it does not. No power! So this is a Samsung Galaxy Tab 4. Oh! oh. Yeah. Pretty interesting case. Uh, it's got the swivel, it's got a little camera, it's got the jack on the top. Power button, volume buttons on the side, charge port, and this side's totally blank. No! 
Leave the dog food alone. But then they'll know. Alright. So, the tablets are wireless, our phones have Wi Fi, the dad has Wi Fi. Um, only thing I didn't have Wi Fi is my desktop computer up here, which, bless my little heart, I'm just so nice. This is like a very expensive computer. <laughs> I've got about, eh, I don't know how much money actually. Well, I'll have to do that sometime. That'd be actually a fun, fun, interesting video to do. <laughs> I am zoomed out all the way. Let me turn it on for you guys. So it's running in a Corsair. I gotta fix that one of the fans is about to go out. But this is all <laughs> built. So I've assembled it piece by piece. Um, the keyboard mouse. Actually the mouse is pretty interesting. I'll do a video on this too. Changes colors. Make a liar out of me, why don't you? Ah, oh, it's because it's doing its boot up. Anyways, oh uh, yeah, I have a quite a bit of parts. So it's an MSI motherboard, um, Corsair case, thousand watt cooler master uh, PSU power supply. Um, did take some cages out. I only have uh, hard disk drives. Do have a yeah, hard disk drive and it says Blu ray, but I'll get into details with that later, anyways. Uh, <laughs> all around nice case, you yeah. got a thousand watts, <laughs> uh, does bevel out a little bit. I guess I just need to go into more detail, anyways. Here we go, show you the mouse so green, pulsing, and then. Uh, We have buttons on the side. Uh, I know you were changing color, not that long ago. Generic stuff from a Walmart. Uh, this is, I forgot what they call it, Black Web. That is the logo for Black Web. Don't believe me, there it is right there. This is their keyboard, which changes color. So there's a, like a lime yellowish green. Obviously a green, which is darker, but obviously it's not showing up because of the lighting. That's off, and then we're red. I want to do red because I got it. <laughs> I ordered the fans, and they were supposed to be white. Just in the regular white LED lights, and they ended up being red. So I went ahead and just decided, okay, fine, let's just do red. There's so many black and red builds, it's ridiculous. I was wanting to do a black outside, white inside, and be done with it. But yeah, and it's going to irritate me. There we go, purple. <laughs> oh, that's what it is. It's sticking. Because my sweetheart doesn't know what she's doing. And this mouse goes blue and all that too, so it's, it's interesting. It's not really called pulsing, they call it a breathing because it dims out slowly and brightens back up. And then I have this. This is a shame. That's why I had to go get that Samsung Tab 4 because this tablet died on me. I don't even know how to troubleshoot this. So that is an Asus tablet. I'll go into details with that one later. So as you can see, I got a lot of videos I can do. Here's our original case boxes for all that. Let me go into detail what comes in it. Little key, little T-Mobile, blah blah blah. Yeah. Uh, my printer is connected on on my network. Everything runs off of that Asus router up there. This is a Pixma Canon printer. Uh, MG5522. I got a shredder down there. That is not, that's just powered by the outlet. Um, does have two USBs, one USB 3.0, one regular 
and then this allows me to actually hook two external hard drives onto oh, I can hear mess with the ball down <laughs> onto my network and I can share them with all my devices very interesting I can go into a little more detail I'll probably do a nice draw out of it and uh, so yeah it's, I bought that because there was central ring well we had Xfinity at the apartment very spotty you can be on it watching your Netflix all of a sudden boom it drops signal it's down we had to have a service guy come out and fix it he comes out and fixes it gets it up and going every time it was like something else was wrong oh they disconnected and thinking that there wasn't a service or oh you know this went wrong and oh you're playing in the water I thought Gizmo only liked water that is a Dachshund Poodle Mix he was a lot here as a puppy now he looks like a walking mop which I probably should throw him over there and mop up the floor <laughs> okay anyways so gave you a little tour of the house uh, I have any questions like oh why well, you got foam pads uh, they're actually you know I can answer all that questions I'll probably go into more detail it's there for child proofing because she's to the point where she can crawl and she likes to pull herself up and stand on her two feet and then she can only do that for so long before she falls uh, uh, I can go into more detail on my gardening out here. Oh yeah, and that irritated me. The guy actually ruined my garden. I've been keeping the dog out, as you can see, with the whole fence. He decides he's gonna step on more freaking plants out here when he was installing that box. And yeah, probably because, oh yeah, look, a ledge there, so he can do that. Just frustrating. Anyways. No, well, that's all taken care of when I get done. I'll do another video and then we'll go from there. Until then, thanks for watching and I will talk to you hopefully within a couple days. <laughs> Whenever I get this done, it will probably be a weekend. It's only a Tuesday. Frustrating. Anyways, please uh, comment if you have any questions or any ideas. I'm more open to listening and trying to learn and apply and you know discuss I'm all about that and um, you haven't please subscribe so when I do put my videos out I'm not like everyone else who wants to cram videos down your throat literally oh I do videos Monday Wednesday and Fridays or I do them every freaking day at this time yeah <laughs> those are people that are obviously trying to make a living off of this money I get going to a saving account for a little Rosalind here that's that's the only purpose I'm doing this for Really, I just want to put the videos up and <laughs> just get a discussion going on and advice, learning, you know, you know, how I decide to go about fixing it and how you guys would suggest of <laughs> fixing it or, or point out my mistakes. You know, it's just that sort of thing. Plus, on top of that, it's more of a documentary, so when she gets older, she can look back and be like, oh, yeah, so here were some videos my dad did and... And, uh, you know, those are the pieces he was using, and look, <laughs> I've got the camera right here type deal, because I'm not really the type of throwaway stuff. Yeah, that does not make me a hoarder. I am not a hoarder. <laughs> okay, so, please subscribe, leave any comments, like me if you thought it was good, you know, put a, click the little thumbs up if you thought this was bad, you know, click thumbs down. I do one of those, please just explain why. Uh, anyways, I'm running out of time and I gotta be getting this cleaned up. <laughs> Her fed and put down for a nap and hopefully when she's taking a nap I can work on this before having to head to work. Alright, take care and see you next time.